I'm going through the Lineage OS subreddit last week, and I noticed this heads up post reminding everybody to update their ADB and Fastboot tools install. So I wanted to take this video and remind people that you should be updating your ADB folder. But not only that, I'm going to show you how to update that ADB and Fastboot tools folder. Now I've previously done a tutorial showing you how to update any install of ADB and Fastboot tools. So I'll be linking to that video in the video description. So just as a reminder, you're going to want to download the latest release of the SDK platform tools. This is also known as the ADB and Fastboot tools. And again, I'll be linking to this in the video description. We're just going to download the tools for Windows. They have them for Windows, Mac, and Linux. So download it for your operating system. And then we're going to extract the contents of that file because it's going to be a compressed file. I use 7-zip, but you can also use something like WinRAR or WinZip. So here we have the file that I just downloaded. When I extract the contents of this file, I get the platform tools folder. And this is a folder you may have seen laying around in your, on your hard drive. Because in that folder includes our adb.exe file and our fastboot.exe file, as well as all of the supporting files that are required for those executables to run. Now, if you're not familiar or if you do not know where your ADB install folder is, then you can probably find that out using the ADB space version command. When we type that out, assuming you're in the correct folder, you should get some information about what is currently installed and where it is currently installed. So if we were to update this version of ADB, we're just going to take those files from here. We're going to copy them. And now we're going to find out where our install folder is. And then we're simply going to paste and overwrite these files. The amount of time it takes to copy these nearly 2,000 files will depend on your computer. But we're just going to wait patiently for at least most of these files to copy. There could be some new files being added, which is likely what's happening now. We're eventually going to be given a overwrite prompt. So what we want to do is we want to replace all of the files in the destination. And if you get a prompt like this, we're just going to continue and do this for all the current items. Once that's done, you should see the new files are in that folder now. And that's all we have to do to update ADB and Fastboot tools. It's usually a good idea to go through and make sure your tools are updated at least once a year. Sometimes like this, if you end up installing a bad copy or a bugged version, you could see some issues when you try to use those tools. So one of the good troubleshooting steps is to make sure your tools are up to date.